came later, we started chatting. And the lady said, I keep seeing my dream. This happened in the dream. That happened in the dream. Useless dreams. I said, it's not me. I reject it. Useless, useless dreams. In the dream. 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 Finally, I said, I can't have this communication anymore. Block the person on the phone. Some years later, the person comes out, was arrested, and wrote in the station that this man keep at harassing me in my dream. Yes, sexually harassing me in my dream. The police have the statement, and it was on video. Are you on that duress? He said, no. He harassed me in my dream. She's out of, out of um, this, the station, gets a lawyer, and the lawyer say, if you say dream, Nigerians will insult you. Say it happened in the physical. So she comes out, does a video. The one who says she stays in Canada. She comes out, does a video, and say, I met him. Meanwhile, we have your statements. We have the video. We have the communication. And the law said, don't talk. You are not following what I'm talking about. We have all that evidence. The police said, Apostle, want to release it. Want to release it. I said, keep quiet. Keep it. Don't talk. You think it's easy? When you have what can, what can vindicate you in one minute. And God said, don't talk. One time I sat in the airport. I said, Lord, my reputation. He said, you still have reputation? I made myself of no reputation. Listen, no, I'm not telling you I'm a perfect man. No. I'm stubborn. No. God is still working on me. <laughs> I'm not a perfect man, but I'm not that dirty thing that is being pointed. But the Lord will tell you, don't talk. It's, it, it, you see, obey, obeying God is hard, though. When you see several lies and several narratives, you actually know this person. You've discussed with this person, but you never met this person. But the picture out there is being twisted, and the Lord said, don't talk. Ha! Like I said, if not that these are stories of the past, I won't mention it to you. Some of my sons, you see, are boiling and angry. It's because they know the truth. What I'm trying to let you know, have you been lied against? They say you stole something. And the Lord, you know, they're choosing Jesus. And the Lord said, he opened not his mouth. Have you been lied against? Have you been accused of what you know you don't know anything about? And the Lord said, don't talk. No talk. Me, no talk. Me, I must say my side of the story. They can't kill somebody and somebody keep quiet. The world is wicked. Somebody cried to me 15 years ago. My landlord is about to throw me out of the house. My landlord is about to kick me out of my house. Help me, help me, help me. And I sent money. A million naira from my account. 14 years later, that person brings out that account statement. As an evidence against me. So, I am committing sin with you, which is a private matter. I now want to send money to you. I will use my direct account. That's why I call Mumurich. Am I that daft? I should be smarter than that now. I should use, I should use another account to transfer. But the Lord said, don't talk. Abba! God, what did I do you? This world is wicked. 